It used to be that your kid wanted to be an astronaut, a teacher, or a firefighter, but now you might hear a YouTuber, a gamer, or become Insta-famous. And there's a million and one ways to do it. But as one triad mother found out, you need to be careful about who you trust or you could end up out of cash. WFMY News 2's Adoria Chuba has her warning for families. When some talent scouts visited Greensboro, they told Carrie Brooks they'd take her twins to Hollywood after a brief audition. They were all excited, but what happened next had her scratching her head and canceling her check. I really didn't think it was all going to happen that quick because it happened pretty fast in about like, what? Two, one day. How quickly a talent so scout discovered the Brooks boys wasn't um, all that had the Brooks family concerned. Me. They say the scouts yeah, made really them offers that seemed too actually, good to be true. Really. One of them would get a full scholarship to it, um, $10,000 worth. And then that we would need to pay, you know, we would get a discount on one of them. $3,000 off of that, so we needed to come up with $6,995. The request for money up front didn't end there. They wanted us to give them at least $1,000 that night to hold their spot. They said if we didn't do that, then their spot you know, would not be held, that they would have to give the opportunity to someone else. So Carrie wrote a check but got a bad feeling and canceled it the next day. She also reached out to an agency the one, one of the scouts they claimed to work with. He said, you do not pay anything for stuff like that. We pay you. And he said, we work off commission when we find you jobs. Now, the agents said they work for AMTA, which is a legitimate scouting company, but it has a better business bureau score of D plus for unresolved claims. Now, we checked one of the agents Facebook pages and found other parents asking for refunds. Now, the BBB says a general rule of thumb, parents should do their research and go with their gut feelings before paying anyone anything. So the question is, why isn't this illegal? Well, the agents or scouts are selling you a service, whether it's photography or acting classes, but you should ask yourself if it's of any real value.